hello blessed family you're welcome once again to my youtube channel my name is bola if you're coming across my channel for the very first time you're welcome please before you go kindly click on the subscribe button subscribe to my channel and um to my returning subscribers thank you so very much i'm not taking your love for granted thank you for the immense show of love at all times thank you for watching my videos whenever i drop new ones and I pray that God continue to bless you and yours always in Jesus' name. Amen. So today tutorial, we'll be making a long gathered gown. A long gathered gown. This is a simple illustration of what we'll be making for today. It's a long gathered gown. And we can see that uh, it's in three tiers. It's in three layers. The upper parts the middle part and the third part the third layer okay this is what we'll be making the gathered gown the free gown is a gathered gown so for the upper part i'll be making use of this pattern i drafted i have this before i think i used this in my last tutorial or thereabout this is one of this is the pattern i'll be using for the upper part for this part i'll be making use of this pattern and in cutting out my middle layer, I'm going to be noting what I have here. Remember that the paper is on fold. It's on fold. I'll be noting what I have here. This is 13.5. I have 13.5. When I open it up, it will be 27. Okay, but it's on fold 13.5. And to that 27, I'll be adding 10 inches because it's just a, I just want to have a little gather to it. I'll be having 10 inches. I'll be adding 10 inches to the 27 inches that I'll be cutting out. I'll be adding 10 inches to the front panel and 10 inches to the back panel. I'll be using this. Or to cut out for both the front and the back so for each piece i'll be adding 10 inches and the length of the middle part the length of the upper part is 10 inches the length of this upper part is 10 inches i'll be adding 0 0.5 steam allowance to it to join it to the second layer i'll be adding and if you are the type that uses one inch allowance please feel free to use or one inch for your joining allowance but for me i think i'll be using 0 0.5 to join it to the lower parts and the middle part i'll be cutting out 40 inches for the length 40 inches for the length i'll also be adding my allowance joining allowance which is 0 0.5 and the third layer i'll be cutting out 10 inches i'll be adding 0 0.5 steam egg allowance as well joining allowance as well so in all the gown length i'll be working with is 60 inches the gown length is 60 inches okay so without further ado i'll first of all cut out this uh, upper piece so i've cut for the upper piece this is the front and the back piece. So I have to mark it to indicate the uh, right side from the wrong side. So this is the upper piece. And I, I cut about 11.5 shoulder allowance inclusive. This is about 11.5. Shoulder allowance inclusive. So when I join the shoulder and I attach this point to the middle piece, it's going to fall back to my 10 inches. And note that I cut it sideways. I cut it sideways. I cut it this way. Sideways. That is how I want the upper piece to fall. And this is the middle part 
this is the middle part i've also cut for both the front and the back so i'm going to gather it i'm going to gather it that it will fall in place to this measurement I'm, i'll take it to my sewing machine i'll gather the front i'll also gather the back all right And this is the last piece, the third layer. This is the third layer. I'll also be gathering it. I'll also gather it so that it's going to fit with the middle piece. So these are the three pieces I have now. I'll take it to my sewing machine to gather it up and attach it. Then I'll be bringing it back to you to show you the final results. So this is how it's going to be this is the upper piece when i gather it i'm going to fold this way you can note the design difference i actually cut it that way just to make a difference you can note the design difference that is quite different i cut this one sideways and i cut this one uh straight okay i'm going to take it to my sewing machine to gather it up now so here is a gathered gown i've gathered the middle piece and i've attached it to the first layer i've also got the third piece and i've attached it to the second piece i've joined it at the side i've also attached my sleeve to the gown i'll be putting it on my body foam so you'll be seeing how beautiful the gown is I also attach a side pocket to the gown. Okay, so if you're yet to subscribe to my channel, please kindly subscribe. On this channel, we do DIY on sewing. Thank you, and I will see you in my next one. Bye.